Let's suppose the consumer's income doubles and that the price of both x and y also double. What's going to be the net effect? Well, let's start with the general budget line. Now remember, we're going to intersect the x-axis at the point where income is divided by the price of x. That's the maximum amount of x we can purchase. Our y-intercept will be income divided by the price of y. That'll be the maximum amount of y we can purchase with our income. The slope of any budget line is going to be the negative of the price of x divided by the price of y. So I'm going to connect my points and I'm going to label it BL1 for budget line 1. Now we're going to double our income and double our prices. So our new x-intercept is going to be 2 times income divided by 2 times the price of x. Well those 2's are going to cancel giving me I divided by PX, which is the same as my initial X-intercept. I can look at the Y-intercept and see that it's going to be symmetric in this case. It'll be 2I divided by 2PY. The 2's are going to cancel, and my Y-intercept is also going to be the same. Well, if my X-intercept doesn't change and my Y-intercept doesn't change, then my budget line isn't going to change. And I'm just going to label BL2 equal to BL1. Well, let's just double check. Let's verify that our slope didn't change here. Now our initial slope is the negative of PX over PY. Our new slope is going to be 2 times PX over 2 times PY. Since the price of both goods doubled, that 2 is going to cancel and my slope is the same.